But anyway, since we're reading about the mark, let me, about the, the chip, which is the mark, I'm going to show you an actual photograph. This is an actual photograph. This is a diagram of the chip. So you better get See, hit. Yeah, now. You better get, get hit one of these soon. about the chip. <laughs> Get hip to the chip or you might get whipped. <laughs> What's that? That's going in your arm, right? This, this is one that goes, this is the actual thing that's gonna, they're going to put in your forehead. Yeah. Which they're already doing. They're doing. They're doing it with animals right now. Yeah. And then your food you eat at McDonald's and Burger King. That, that's right. Yeah. But that has nothing to do with it. Actually, they're going to actually put that mark in there. In other words, this is going to replace the money system. Right now, you can take out what's called paper money, that's right. or currency, and or you can use a card. debit card or a yeah, credit yeah. card. So what they're going to do is they're going to say, you know what? You need that. We're not going to deal with it. We're going to, they, in other words, what they might do too, they're planning on setting up a big economic crash where this society goes bankrupt. Yeah. They said the only way you can deal now is with this cashless society. Yeah. And no, and for nobody to steal your credit card, we're going to put the the, the uh, chip, chip in, in your yeah. in your right hand or in your forehead. All right, and that's what they're planning on doing, all right? And here it is, like I said, they already have the technology. Yep. That's an actual photograph of one of the chips that they plan on putting in, whoever accepts it, your or right hand or in your forehead. Right. That's the chip right here. That's the chip. Found in the book Hold it up high, so brother. Better, so you better get hip. You heard it here first. That's what you're going to be having in your hand. <laughs> well, see? Found in the book of Revelation. That's your chip right now, there. Read something. Uh, for, for those of you that don't believe the Bible is uh, accurate, the Bible speaks about. Now nah, you're gonna get a chip soon, brother. Uh, you gonna get a spirit, brother. Right, right, right. Yeah, yeah. because he uh, he might be one of us. Now let me let me let me let me read this. All right, it said it is the same concept as the vehicle identification number, VIN, system for cars. Uh, similarly, the uh, biochip. Now the word bio. Anytime you hear the word bio, it means body. All right. Something to do with the human body, all right? Uh, similarly, the biochip's number remains with individually implant, implanted animals for life, allowing them to be traced, tracked, and controlled. Current state-of-the-art biochip, bio meaning the body, right? Transponders are encased in teeny glass tubes about the size of a grain of rice. It says the injectable transponder, a uh, passive radio frequency tag. Okay? Same thing as that thing they scan in the supermarket. The same, the same concept, all right? Now it says, it says here, global economic system of the Antichrist world dictator, a man whose number is 666, will call for just... Now, by the way, you got these people in the hip-hop world, if they want to make... There was a reason why 3-6 Mafia got that Oscar uh, for that song. <laughs> because 3-6 Mafia, 3-6... Right. It means 3 sixes. Right. Uh, what, is, what is this guy? That, they, they said he got killed. Uh, 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 Tupac. Tupac. Yeah. He came out with an al uh, album before he died. Uh, supposedly, it came out after he died. It was called Killuminati uh, Mac, Mac, Machiavelli. Now Machiavelli ties in, I'm not going to go deep into Machiavelli, but Machiavelli ties into this whole 666 system going back to the 1400s, all right? It says, uh, it says, global economic system of the Antichrist, world dictator, a man whose number is 666, will call for just, for call, uh, will call for just such an alphanumeric uh, identification system. Such a planetary network will enable the Illuminati's New World Order, UN-controlled world government to assign everyone on Earth a specific and unique ID number for tracking and control. So this brother mentioned about the uh, Patriot Act to spy on you, now they're going to really spy on you because they're going to go to the next act. Now the only way we can spy on you because you can steal somebody's cell phone. We got to put this chip in you so we, because we, you might be a terrorist. And if you say, I don't want to take the chip, that means you hiding something. Mm -hmm. So you got you to gotta know not to take this chip, even unto death. Yeah. If they're going to put you in jail, 
damn it, go to jail. Yeah. If they're gonna kill you, damn it, be allow yourself to be killed. Yeah, because um, um, they got a company called Halliburton. Halliburton, they got a six million dollar contract to build detention centers. Yeah. Now the detention centers is just like jail. A holding pen. Those, those are for the people that don't want to accept the chip. If they come to you and they say, look, you, you better take this chip, and you say, no, I don't want the chip, because I read in Revelations, it's against God's law, they're going to throw your ass in that detention center. But and, then, it, and, and then, that's also in the book of Revelation too, because it speaks about how the devil will, will uh, uh, cast some of you into prison. Because like I said, they got, matter of fact, um, they got a website, a FEMA website, and, and FEMA's, on that FEMA website, they got a list of all the detention centers all across America. In California alone, they got six newly built detention centers with nobody in there. What are those detention centers for? And they're keeping that out of the media. The, the average person don't even know about that. Those centers are for when all hell breaks loose and society breaks down and, they, and the, the, the New World Order guys want control. They're going to throw certain people in those detention centers. And you, and you know what? Now, he just read out of Daniel, the 12th chapter, about there should be a time of trouble. You got a lot of patriots, patriots them white people down south, that call themselves reading the Bible. And they read about this and they go on websites like Alex Jones. Now, did you see that interview with Alex Jones on CNN? Yeah, yeah. Uh, they, I was man. I put CNN on, and they said we gonna have. And I said what? Alex Jones. And then they had him on, and they and they let him say whatever the hell he want. He was on that thing for about five minutes. I said they gonna cut him off. He said I said they gonna cut him off. They let him keep talking. And then Alex Jones commended the guy. He said I gotta commend you guys. I gotta commend you for having the guts to allow me on. Because if I was on any other TV okay, show or network, on. you would have cut me off. They let him say what he had to say, and then he moved on. And it was all setting around this thing. Uh, there was an interview with Alex Jones with Charlie uh, Sheen. Charlie Sheen, all right? Now, he could be a Jake, because he's from yeah, he's Spaniard. Yeah. He could be a Jake. Yeah. So he's going, now it's all on the media that he's saying that the World Trade Center, that thing was all planned, that the president had something to do with it. You want to read something out of it? Because you got, you familiar with it, you know, what points to hit. Can I make one point? Yeah. That's why Jesus Christ, well, the world calls him Jesus Christ, but we now know his name is Yahweh Shah. That's why he said what? He said, watch as well as pray. Now, what are you supposed to be watching for? You're supposed to be watching for these signs, like... Um, You're supposed to be watching for the emergence of the beast right. in Revelation, which right. people...